All right, welcome back. Welcome back to the Vessel Brie, baby. That's me, baby. You all right, Ting, now. <laughs> We're going to start with this channel message, y'all. I got this last night. Yeah, last night. So I'm going to start with the channel message, then we're going to go to, to Tara to clarify. All right, but this is like um, an energy where it's like something is extremely, like, messed up. Like, I'm hearing somebody say, like, what the fuck, oh my gosh. Like, somebody's surprised. Something's very shocking or surprising. Like, somebody, I see, like, somebody's mouth dropping type of thing, okay? Somebody's name could be Tyler, yours or someone else's, all right? Um... But there's a situation where, like, the police is involved, all right, or, or, like, illegal instances, occurrences, all right, Allegheny could be significant. Um, use, something's, like, something's either happening in the jails or it's happening inside, like, a school or some type of institution here, all right? It's, like, something, um... I mean, like, something's, like, interestingly intriguing another person or multiple people, all right? But I'm getting, there's, like, something going, something crazy going on inside a jail or inside some type of school building, county here, all right? And it has to do with, like, um, someone who works in some type of institution here is connected to another institution, however that makes sense, all right? This could also invo involve, like, institutions that do, like, hold, um, like, juvenile jails, kids like that, all right? It's like, I kept getting an energy where somebody's like, this is so messed up, this is extremely messed up, all right? And how something needs to be done about it. Because um, I see something backfiring or will backfire, all right? Depending on, like, who receives this message or what's going on here. All right, but there's, like, um, a person drugging someone inside these institutions here. Um, and these are people who don't want to do drugs, but they're, like, abusing these people by, like, drugging them or making them do certain drugs. Like I said, it could be... Um, like, and then I got, like, I heard, like, the questions that need to be asked is, like, is a teacher giving students drugs? Is the officer drugging inmates? Okay? Something like that. All right? Because it's something where, like, somebody's not just a teacher. Somebody's not just uh, an officer or a worker in this institution. They're also, like, um, they could be a stripper or escort outside of work. But it's not, like... Because, you know what I mean, like, not judging anyone. It's like somebody lives the fast life where they're able to, like, get in contact with certain drugs, things like that. And then as well as, you know, working um, in a, a high institution where they're abusing their power against these these kids. And it doesn't have to be kids, right? Because we did say the jail, but it's against people's will. Drugging them against people's will. Like, literally, th this could be, like, people passing away with the death card here and the five of pentacles, that's jail, inside the jail here. If there's a lot of, um, I'm hearing overdoses inside of a jail, like this is why. There's people in isolation that are needing help. And look at the, look at the, um, the suit here with the keys. It's like a armor here. Someone who's supposed to be an official person, right? This could even, wow, this could even be like uh, uh, officers getting inmates pregnant in jail and then like using drugs or a certain drug, giving them drugs or something like that for them to like basically have an abortion for the child to literally night of ones and the, the, the death for them to like um, take action to abort the child here. This could also have to do with, like, sexual abuse and then them doing this. All right, y'all. So, four or four on the clock. Queen of Wands. That's, like, the, um... That's fire sign energy, but that's giving, like, very, like... Very respected as well, but it's, like, in this... That's what the Queen of Wands is, very respected, very, like, supportive of others, very mystic-like. But I'm getting, like, a, I don't know, I'm getting, like, a promiscuous energy off of um, this Queen of Wands card. Like, there's a lot of, like, promiscuous energy or, like, sex work going on or just, like, sex is what I'm getting here. Or woman, uh, woman being sexualized inside certain facilities. Uh, this could be younger or older woman. 
This is community here. This is protection, protecting or to protect your energy. Yeah, defense. Somebody's like having to defend themselves from from whatever this is. Three of because none of these cards are in the reverse. Three of um three of cups in reverse is also like a, a crowd, a group of people or people gossiping about this. It's also overindulgence. Like I'm getting like forcing, I don't know why I'm getting an energy towards women as well to like get drunk and take abuse of women. Yeah, look, five, five of swords. Control, manipulation. And then like bullies, bullying type of um, energy. Aquarius energy strong here. Leo energy. Transition. Someone could be 56, somebody could be 37, somebody could be 35, somebody could be 36. And then the chariot. That's the that's the cops. That's the officers. That's this is this represents um cop cars as well sometimes here. Somebody with power or departure, somebody who releases the I'm getting like the release part of something like somebody who Somebody who releases um, inmates or releases, like, like takes care of, like, um, what's the word I'm thinking of? Admission? Admission in a school or admission in this, this institution here. It's like somebody's had to really defend and protect themselves from a group of, of people, a group of promiscuous or abusive people is what I'm getting here. And don't get me wrong, this could, this could be... The Queen of Wands, Janika's you know, Tara has no gender. This could be a woman doing this, or this could be a man. But I do feel a heavy en energy against a group of of women or a group of um, younger women having to protect themselves as well. Yeah, Page of Wands here in, in, in Knight of Cups. This is children right here. Cancer energy. <clears throat> And the page of wands can 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 represent childish, immature energy. So that's that's confirming like the the childish energy that I'm getting here. But why is this this happening here? Knight of Swords. For some of you guys, this, this is happening like to people who they don't want to speak up. This could also be verbal abuse here. I do see that with the Six of Swords, this situation is going to be um, figured out or handled. Somebody's going to be able to move on or lead, lead like something. Something's going to change here within a within a community. Six of Cups. This also signifies um, children, or this could have been like a, a past situation as well that's still occurring, or like a case or something here. Yeah, the Rea Swords here. This could also be like there was some type of separation happening within a community, within this, this place. I also feel like somebody's been trying to like get away or separate themselves from this crowd, from this situation. Yeah, the Magician in reverse, the Empress in reverse, the Nine of Swords in reverse. This is also signifying like how I feel again with like the way that I'm looking at this this um this Seven of Swords, this protection right here is also like somebody trying to like I said take advantage and then with the Empress in reverse, I'm getting in the in the in the Three of Swords, it's like in the magician trying to like manipulate pregnancies. Or just manipulate in general. And then you have judgment in reverse. Yeah. I'm also getting like a lot of these a lot of these are like forms of like trying to keep people quiet or keep them from speaking up on something or like 
when 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 they do like when something like this occurs or when something bad occurs, they like drug these people to keep them yeah unbalanced from from saying anything. But then Ace of Wands here, I feel like there's gonna be some type of good news that comes in about this situation, about something being handled here. Yeah, Eight of Cups. Somebody's gonna reevaluate something or or. I'm hearing somebody overlooked something. So somebody's going to reevaluate something or look into something or overlook some type of documents or case, whatever this is. And I feel like this is going to um, allow these people or whatever the situation to walk away, to move away. What else do we have? Ooh. Yeah, y'all, because when I got this download, I was like, yeah, this is the Hermit, the investigation card. So this could be getting investigated or or will be getting investigated here. This is Virgo energy as well. I feel like if you're dealing with this situation, um, you could be in a, or you could be in isolation. If you're dealing with the situation, I feel like Spirit's guiding you to kind of isolate yourself as a form of protection. Yeah, four of wands. This could also be happening inside of a household, a home. I feel like somebody's defending someone, standing up for someone, or there's going to be some type of, um, this could be I'm getting a public defender. Eight of Pentacles. Yeah, I feel like somebody's working on this. Or in the beginning, like I said, somebody who works in some type of institution or facility um, may have may have may get released. But I also feel like somebody working on the, on the inside of something here, some type of investigation, is going to receive good news. Yeah, Wheel of Fortune at the bottom of the deck. Something's going to change here. There's a lot of choices and decisions to be made, but I feel like the burden's going to be. Um, released but I also feel like some type of um, I don't know why I'm getting some type of death could be getting investigated as well yeah that's the truth with the ace of swords and there's gonna be some type of breakthrough within some type of case here investigation or whatever is being looked into yeah, the chariot. Someone's going to change. Somebody's going to be able to um, move on from the situation. I feel like there, there could even possibly be some type of reward here. But I'm also getting, again, with the, the heartbreak and the devil card. Devil is addiction, suffering, grief, hurt, emotional pain, depressed. And then I'm getting this as, like, this cop, this chariot here, giving to the to the people to, who are heartbroken, who are hurt or separated from... The outside world is what I'm getting here. Like I said, in, in trap, bound, and imprisonment, getting them addicted or, or going towards them with um, temptation. This could be why people or they've been acting in some type of place and some type of destructive behavior because they're dealing with this destructive person. Like I said, the illusion here is the, is what the illusion here is. How I'm looking at this is hidden deaths within jail, hidden deaths within some type of institution. And there's a group here, or it could even be a couple working together um against these people who are like i'm saying like i said are in poverty and some of these in like basically in isolation but I also feel like there's like a, a a couple working on a case as well but yeah there's some type of i mean you even see the chains here this is temptation this is sex this is lux lust this is a addiction this is toxicity I'm getting that, that cycle's about to be closed out. Completion, fulfillment, as well as, you know, with that Ace of Wands, good news, a breakthrough coming, as well as, as well as with the Ace of Swords here. Someone could be 53 or 21. All right, so I feel like something has been a challenge or something may be very challenging. Um, there's been a lot of manipulation involved, but I feel like at the end of the day, when something's all said and done, when something's um, over, there, there's good news. There's a breakthrough. I didn't see the justice card, but I did see like the, the world card. Something's going to be completed. Or have you been fighting this, battling this? Yeah, I've been working at something for a, for a long time, working on it very, very hard. There's the there's the four of ones again. Like I said, community. I don't know why I'm getting courthouse as well. Or um, there's going to be some type of celebration here after after something is 
exposed or you're enlightened about something or gain a new perspective about something, there's going to be a change here within this situation. There's going to be a change. All right, y'all. Um, so I'm going to leave it right there. It's 15 minutes. I really hope to help somebody out in their situation, gain some more information to really you know, bring this situation to an end. And I'm looking at this protection again here with the seven of wands here. So I feel like there needs to be protection over this, you know, this community, this institution, this whatever this is um, resonating for within your situation. All right. And that that will be occurring here. Okay. So that's what I have for you guys. Peace.